YouTube. Hey, welcome back. So, I wanted to give you guys a fairly quick video update of my T-Max 3.3. It's been a minute since you guys have seen it. Um, it's been down and out for a minute. Uh, if you guys have been keeping up with, with my uh, T-Max posts, you guys would know <clears throat> that, uh, I don't know, maybe what, two months ago, a month and a half ago, something like that, uh, I, well, we blew the engine on it. Um, basically, we were out running it, and um, it just shut off on us. No, no real reason. No, we were just driving it, you know, and it just stopped, so... Long story short, I took it off part, contacted Traxxas, they said, well, they said send it in and, you know, we'll let you know if we're going to re replace it or if you got to purchase another one. I said, okay. Now, the thing about it is, um, you know, I had only ran a gallon and a half through it, through, through, the, through the engine. So I'm kind of like, man, you know, I mean, I didn't really get that much runtime out of it. It was only, only a couple months. So I packaged it all up and I sent it off to Traxxas. And they contacted me via email and said, hey, you know, we covered it. I'm like, sweet. So um, I got to give kudos to Traxxas. Um, you know their their customer service is is is, is really good. <coughs> Excuse me, I'm still dealing with a little bit of a cough here. Um, but I mean, I, I've I've contacted them a couple other times as well, not just for this issue, but for a couple others, and they've been real knowledgeable. But I just want to give kudos to Traxxas because um, you know if if I would have been forced to purchase another engine, I probably would have just sold sold it as a as a roller and been done with it um but anyways long story short you know the 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 piston cracked in half and it came separated from the sleeve or the, i'm sorry the sleeve cracked in half it came separated from the um the head anyways whatever um i got the new engine here it is okay brand new it's not even it's not even in the truck yet. <laughs> um, there's a reason for that, and I'm about to get to it. Here's the other piece. There it goes on the front of that, like so. Um, <clears throat> anyways, the reason why this isn't on the truck is because. The exhaust header, I don't have. I should have did a little bit better research, or homework rather, on my end, before sending it in. I knew, you know, I knew that certain things weren't supposed to go with it, but I, I apparently, um, I, I dropped the ball on that because, according to Traxxas, you're supposed to take this entire drive shaft assembly off it. You're just supposed to, you know, the drive shaft, drive shaft assembly, take the starter or the um, pull start or easy start off, you know, instead of the carburetor and pretty much this, okay, the block. Um, so I appreciate them sending me back my drive shaft components because um, that was one thing that I shouldn't have sent them, but I did, and they sent, they, they sent them back to me. So I thank them for that. Um, but what I didn't get, what I didn't get back, was the exhaust header. You know, which is the piece that comes out of here, it loops around and goes to your exhaust. I didn't get that back, so I'm like, shoot, what am I gonna do? Because I'm like, well, you know, it technically is my fault that I sent it to them. I should have done a better job of researching and doing homework and figuring out what I needed to send and what I didn't need to send. So after kind of debating back and forth uh, whether or not to just purchase the part um, and by the way I, I did price that part that parts 20 bucks it's just the exhaust header it's like a 
two inch curved pipe. It was 20 bucks. I'm like, dang, man. So, uh, my wife was like, hey, why don't you call Traxxas and see if they can just ship you out a new one. I'm like, I could, but it's my fault, you know? Anyways, long story short, I called him and I explained to him, like, look, I'm sorry, I apologize, you know, I mean, I told you, I said, look, it's my fault. I said, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't do my, my homework, I didn't, even, I didn't do my research, it's, you know, I apologize, it is my fault. I said, you know, is there, is there any possibility that, you know, you guys could just shit me out, my, you know, the one that I sent in? He said, well, he said, you know. He said, I'll tell you what, he said, as a courtesy, I'll just send you out a brand new, brand new piece. I said, okay, sweet. So, again, I, you know, I think Trax is for that, that saved me 20 bucks. Now, mind you, it's been almost a week now, you know, that I've been waiting, um, but it saved me 20 bucks. I mean, they, they paid for shipping and everything. So, enough about that. Thank you, Traxxas. I got my brand new engine. It has to be broken in. Um, it's brand new from the factory. Net has not been used once. Okay, so I gotta break that in. Um, just take a quick look, peek, quick look at this. This thing is beat up. I mean, this thing is just beat up. Um, I cut this out for the pull start, cracked it all up. Um, but anyways. It is, it is what it is. It's a it's a basher body, um, but as you guys can see, I mean, the thing's pretty clean. You know, I over the last month, you know, if you guys again were keeping up with the, my my videos, you guys seen I did a um, little cleaning video on it, cleaned it up pretty good. Uh, but everything's back assembled. Um, all the missing pieces have been put back on. Uh, everything's good to go. So. I'm literally just waiting for the for the exhaust uh, manifold here, or the header manifold. Um, I almost mounted this in there, and then I realized now nah, it's probably a bad idea because I have to, you know, put that piece on there, which which goes from the back. So I probably wouldn't have enough space back there to do this. So I just kept it off. But um, when I get when I get um, the exhaust header in the mail hopefully this week um, I will be mounting this to the truck and throwing some batteries in the receiver and transmitter and uh, we'll, 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 we'll be outside with it so hopefully we got some nice weather over the weekend and I'll be able to get this thing get this thing broken in and get it back on the road so uh i think that's about it guys video went a, lot, a little longer than anticipated but just wanted to give you guys a quick update on the t-max uh like i said i know i i know it's been a minute since you guys have seen it um <clears throat> like i said i just wanted to let you guys know that um you know, Trax has helped me out. They came through for me. Um, like I said, they sent me a brand new engine. And then due to my my error, um, they're also sending me out a $20 exhaust header. And paying for the shipping. And it, it didn't cost me a penny. Like I said, you know, it, it, it's probably on a situational basis. I'm not telling anybody that tracks is you know shipping stuff off for free that's not what i'm saying you know i'm not saying that tracks is going to replace your engine for free that's not what i'm saying i'm just saying for my situation you know uh tracks just came through for me and i definitely appreciate it so i'm saying so i hope you guys enjoyed this video and as usual please comment like and subscribe uh, like I said, there's going to be more video content coming. I got the, the tracks is coming up. Or, I'm sorry, the, not the tracks. It's the T-Max coming up here. I'm uh, going to get this engine put back in it. We got the rustler already rolling. Um, so, you know, go ahead and hit that like, that, that like button for me, the thumbs up. Uh, go ahead and tap on that subscribe button for me. 
this week, guys, to stay up to date on my videos. And, you know, I thank you guys for uh, watching this. And uh, until next time, as usual, see y'all later.